Thank you to Ritual for sponsoring. More on them later. Join me for some winter wardrobe organization and inspiration today on The Daily Connoisseur. Jennifer here and welcome back. If you're new to my channel, I do the 10 item capsule wardrobe. It's a concept that I discovered while living in Paris and I write about it in my Madame Chic series books, which I will leave linked down below. So today we're going to talk about winter wardrobe organization. I believe it's crucial to go through your wardrobe each season at the very least and to take out all non-seasonal items, put them away, and only have the current season hanging in front of you. This is going to give you clarity and this is what we're going to be doing today on the channel. I'm going to take you to the wardrobe in just a minute, but before we do that, I'm going to tell you about what I'm packing away from fall. So in my 10 item capsule wardrobe for fall, which I was so happy with, I felt like it performed beautifully. I am packing away three pieces from my core items. And the first one is this gorgeous Lily Silk Claret Silk blouse. And this was an absolute superstar during the holiday season. And it looked so good in pictures and it was perfect for gatherings. I love this blouse. I am going to pack it away now and I'll probably bring it out next November or so. That one was really good. Another piece that I'm packing away from Lily Silk, and I could honestly wear this piece all year round, but it's this gorgeous deep olive silk blouse. And I forgot to button it here, but this was my favorite piece probably because I felt like the color was really good for me. I love olive and it's beautiful. So while I really could still wear this during the winter, I am going to pack it away because when I bring it out at the end of August, beginning of September of 2024, I'm going to be so excited to see it. And it really is a fall color for me, so I'm gonna be packing this away. And then finally, the Rungali dress, which I wasn't sure I was going to bring back because I damaged it a bit. I'm going to be packing this away. I don't know if this is going to come back yet. I haven't decided. It went through a lot. There's a long backstory to that. You could watch my other videos, but I turned it blue on accident <laughs> and lost a button. So there's a few things that happened to it, but it still performed so well during the fall season. I pretty much retired this after Thanksgiving. That's going to be going away. I just wanted to mention that as well. So packing away the things that are really fall. And you know, when you hang them up, you can really see that they are fall, winter, holiday colors. And as we move into the 2024 new year, I'm moving into you know a different wintry color palette. So what am I bringing back from last year? There were two winter blouses that are going to replace the two that I am retiring, and both are from Lily Silk. Do you remember this beautiful Amalfi striped blouse? I love this blouse. It's so whimsical and fun, and I love stripes. I love blue and white stripes specifically. So this blouse is great, and you're seeing B-roll here of me wearing the blouse with the different bottoms that I have in my core items. This blouse looks great with jeans. It looks great with the Franny Goldie black trousers. It also looks great with the black skirt by Sky. This is coming back just for the winter season. I love it. And then you'll remember this one. And you'll remember the Ameria lace blouse. This is a silk blouse with lace sleeves. And this still looks really good. I'm bringing this back as well. It goes with the other pieces in my core items. And I think that this beautiful cream color is so good for winter. So this is also coming back. This is not a core item, it's from my extras, but it's this cardigan from Sky that I've had for years. And again, I love the nautical theme, so I'm bringing back this extra, and this goes with all of the other pieces as well. Now, when I hung everything up, I noticed something. So let's go to my closet now, and I'll share with you what I noticed. But before we go to the closet, I'm going to take a minute to tell you about Ritual, who have kindly sponsored today's video. This new year, trade unrealistic resolutions for daily habits that stick. You can get 40% off all of Ritual's clean, traceable, and science-backed products. This is the best time to buy because this is one of the highest offers you've ever seen for Ritual. I've been taking their Essentials for Women 18 Plus multivitamin for years. It's a clinical-backed multivitamin formulated with key high-quality nutrients to help fill common dietary gaps. It's vegan-friendly, non-GMO project verified, gluten-free, major allergen-free, without extras, and artificial colorants. 
I find it easy and pleasurable to take due to the mint tab in the bottle. But I also trust this vitamin because the ingredients are made traceable so you know where they come from. Ritual goes above and beyond industry standard, seeking the most rigorous certifications and testing every batch of products for heavy metals, microbes, and allergens. I take my Ritual multivitamin every day. I've done it for years. This sale is for a limited time only. You can get 40% off your first month when you use my code Daily Connoisseur 40 along with my link, or you can scan the QR code right here. Thank you so much to Ritual for sponsoring today's video. And now back to the fashion. Okay, so these are my winter wardrobe pieces. I don't have everything in here because right now I am wearing my jeans, but you see a lot of the things here. Another thing that's missing is the outer known jumpsuit, which is in the dirty clothes. But what I have done here is, and if you have the space, I do recommend you do this, but I have hung up extras like sweaters right alongside my core items. You know, this is a camisole and that's okay. Sometimes if you really want to get clarity, you can just hang up your core items, but I'm having plenty of room here. And so I'm also hanging up things like t-shirts. Like if I've ironed a t-shirt, it's just easier to hang it up. Uh, because if I fold it, which I do have some folded t-shirts up here, that's fine. But I will also have to iron them again when I wear them again. I also have some of my sweaters hanging up here because it just helps to see everything all together. Okay, so I strongly advocate that you hang up all of your clothes for the season that you're currently in and pack everything else away because I'm able to see what kind of capsule I have created. And while I love my winter wardrobe, I do notice that there is something missing and that is color. The only colorful piece that I have is the Rungli Melody Midi Dress in French Berry. And everything else is a neutral. You know I love my neutrals, I love my stripes, I love my creams and blacks and navies, but I noticed that I have a lot of that. So that's why it's helpful to hang it all up. Hang it up as if you were in a chic boutique. Look at your clothing and see what's missing, what you would change about your capsule. So if I were to add anything to my winter wardrobe, it would be color. Okay, so I hope that the closet segment was very helpful for you because when I hang everything up like that, I am really able to see what I'm lacking, what I need, what direction I want to go in. It brings clarity. And I didn't realize how little color I had in my wardrobe. So that's going to be influencing what I put in there. I don't know if I'm going to be adding to my winter wardrobe, um, the winter season in California is pretty short, so I'm not going to be adding like any heavy sweater dresses or anything like that. I don't need them. I can easily wear all the sweaters I have, and I have a few that are perfect for winter with the skirt, the trousers, the jeans, and you know, be warm. But seeing that, it really makes me know that going into spring, I want more vibrant color in my wardrobe, so I will definitely be implementing that. Okay, so let's now talk about some new additions to the wardrobe. I have some new wonderful high quality quality brands and old favorites as well to feature with you. Okay, many of you probably recognize the Monarch set from Nyrell. So I wear their stud earrings all the time. I bought them for myself for my birthday and then I contacted them to see if I could get a discount code and they loved the pieces that I featured it in. So they sent me the Monarch statement set, which is the Monarch butterfly drop earrings and the Monarch butterfly necklace. You know I love butterflies. They're one of the symbols that, you know, kind of drive my life. I love the idea of the metamorphosis and of flying. So uh, butterfly jewelry really speaks to me. These pieces are absolutely gorgeous. I can't wait to play with them this winter. And I just love all the pieces from Nyrell. So I'll leave them down below along with my discount code. Okay, I'm gonna show you some new shoes here. Love to feature new brands, high quality brands that I've loved for years as well. Starting off with the Birdies. These are beautiful. They make shoes that could either be worn as slippers, like these are quilted on the inside. I know it's hard to see with, there you go, with the black, but they're quilted on the inside. They're so comfortable. They have this jeweled bracelet. So these could either be worn as very fancy house slippers or you could absolutely wear these out. I would wear these to the opera, to the orchestra, to the theater. They're gorgeous to a holiday party. I know those are pretty much past, but you could wear them out in the evening. And then Thursday boots make wonderful ballerina shoes. 
And again, you could wear these around the house, but they're also, you know, fashion shoes. I have these in tan and then these are their pink color, a wonderful neutral and just go so well with jeans. I love them. They're from Thursday Boot. The drawstring is functioning, so you can adjust to your foot size and they're just absolutely wonderful. Okay, I'm going to be focusing on exercise a lot this year because I'm being a bit more active and a lot of people have asked about chic workout clothes, chic exercise wear. So let's focus on shoes for a minute. These are by Nothing New and I love Nothing New. They use recycled materials, very sustainable company and I just love their designs as well. Not only are they a conscientious fashion brand, but I just love the style of these and these are walking shoes. They're so comfortable. Okay, let's talk about handbags. I love Teddy Blake. I always feature a bag from Teddy Blake each season. They're just at a great price point for such a high quality bag. And I've been wanting a black bag that was smaller for a long time because the Gigi Palmetto that I have is very large, uh, very office-y. And so this one is much smaller. This is the Chiara Stampetto in 11 inch. One of the signatures I like about Teddy Blake is the hardware that they use. I think it just looks very high end. Hardware is sometimes hard to get right and they get it right. So I have the bag and then I'm also gonna show you the different straps you can get. They sell different accessory straps that can change the look of your bag. So here's a few outfit combinations where I'm playing with the strap. enjoyed today's video and that it gave you inspiration for curating your own wardrobe, for getting organized and expressing your true style. I'd like to thank Ritual for sponsoring. You can get 40% off your first month using code dailyconnoisseur 40 along with my link or you can scan the QR code on the screen. Keep calm and remain classy everyone and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye!